Hi everyone, the aim of this video is to show you how to get your HMRC account set up so we are ready to go to submit your capital gains liability to HMRC. A quick recap of the changes to the rules. Since 6 of April 2020, individuals who are due to pay capital gains tax on UK residential property disposals have 30 days after the completion date to report and pay the tax. The reason it is different is that post 6 of April 2020, residential property disposals must be reported within your personal capital gains tax on UK property account. In order for us to submit this as your accountants, we will need to obtain authorisation, even if we already have authorisation for your self-assessment tax returns. To set up an account, you will need to create a Government Gateway user ID if you do not already have one. The Government webpage I'm on at the moment, we will include a link below to take you straight to the page. If you scroll down and hit start, it will ask you to sign in. If you have not created a Government Gateway ID in the past, you can select Create Sign-in Details here and follow the instructions. HMRC will need to verify your identity to be able to create an ID for you. You can usually do this by entering information from your most recent P60 or using information from your UK passport. Once you've got that, you can enter your sign-in details. It then usually asks you to enter an access code. Once you've entered that and press continue, the next page it shows you your contact details and asks you to confirm that they're correct and then select create an account. Now that you have your UK property account set up, the next step is to get us authorised to be able to file your return. From you we will need your account number and UK postcode. We will then email you a link and ask you to authorise us through this link. Once you've accepted this, the process is complete and everything should be set up to be able to report to HMRC under the new rules. If you're planning to sell a UK residential property soon, for example a buy to let, our tip is to get in contact with us as soon as possible so we can make sure you've got your account set up and we have agent authorisation. If you're a current client of ours, please contact your client portfolio manager and they will be able to help. If you're not yet a client of ours but would like some help, please do get in contact. My email address is abby at peterjarman.com. That brings us to the end of this video, so thank you for listening and hopefully you found it useful.